I was shocked. <laughs> of course I was shocked. Tasia Adams is opening up about stepping into her new role as the Bachelorette host with Caitlin Bristow. The two former franchise leads tag teamed hosting duties for Katie Thurston's upcoming season of The Bachelorette, replacing Chris Harrison after he announced his decision to step away from the franchise. After the fallout for his apparent defense of Bachelor contestant Rachel Kirkinell's past racially insensitive actions. This is a very unprecedented time, and this has just been something that's been so fun for both of us. Caitlin and I really just created this really fun dynamic duo that has never been done before with The Bachelorette, and I feel like it really provided a lot of, I don't know, strength behind Katie and confidence as well, because you're in that situation, and sometimes you don't know what to do. Yeah. And we were able to provide a little bit of clarity and help for her. You know, Katie is a strong, confident woman that knows what she wants, and she's not afraid to do what she has to do to get that, so it's going to be good. While we wait to see Katie's journey to find love, Tasha and Caitlin have their own weddings to plan. Caitlin's engaged! I'm so excited for her. I knew it was coming sometime soon. I just had a feeling. But um, I'm so happy for both of them. Tasha is engaged to her Bachelorette finalist, Zach Clark, and Caitlin recently got engaged to fellow Bachelor Nation alum, Jason Tartik. Oh my God! <laughs> Are you? <laughs> <laughs> Caitlin and I have been talking about wedding stuff since we were filming, so I'm sure down the road, because it just happened now she's in Mexico, we'll talk about it since, sometime soon. I'm just getting my feet wet in New York City. It's The sun is finally out, it's not freaking cold outside anymore, so I'm just enjoying the city for now, but Zach and I are doing well, and I'm sure wedding planning will start sometime soon. Tasia, who first appeared on Colton Underwood's season of The Bachelor, also reacted to his recent coming out as gay. You know, I have I haven't spoken to him, but um, I'm just happy he's able to live in his truth and be happy. 